，这局不要搞，这局不要接。不是，你出来赛季当然你是舔过来了。<笑>他的他的体力，我感觉是这这这次的鼓手里面最充沛的一个。他在整个演演奏过程当中，他的脑子是跟着旋律在走，不只是在弹，他是在玩音乐。因为每个人的身上只是装了一节电池，但是托马斯老师是插着电的。十六分音符的，哎，那个咋个讲法？打就乱勾嘎。嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟，大概有多快？很快，这个，反正反一下，嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟嘟，这个有多快？一二三四，一二三四，一二三四，一二三四。First of all, thanks for joining us, Thomas. Ah, thank you very much. So appreciate for that. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah, you did a great job today. Thank you so much. How how do you feel? I feel good. All the evidence. Everything is amazing. I just want to like definitely appreciate the band that played, the staff, everyone, the sound. Everything is really, really good. We did a good job preparing. Uh, I really had a great time. It was, it was very like was, I'm so overjoyed. I'm, I had a great time. I had a great time. Thank you. Thanks, thanks, thanks. So if uh, we have next year second season, yeah. we will invite you here again for sure. Awesome. Definitely, you awesome. play so amazing, creative. We got a lot of inspiration from you. Thank you so much. And you make the band sound so colorful. Oh man. Yeah, we so enjoy your playing. Wow, thank you. Yeah. Man. Uh, so where you live right now? You could uh, please tell us. Okay, so right now I'm I'm living in Shanghai. I work there. I've been living there now, kind of over over a year now. Uh, I, I've been working there for my career, and I work there in a bar called Chair Club at nights in the evenings. And uh, daytime, I'm teaching at uh, at uh, my studio and also at a school. Um, it's really fun there. Shanghai is cool, and I'm having a great time there. Just being in the city with live music, you know, a lot of musicians, energy. You know, everybody's passionate about the music, about the performance. So it's fun to be there. I love Shanghai. Great, great, great. So please tell us how you start these drum things, where, where it all starts. Okay, so it all started from in Texas, back home in church. Uh, church is kind of where everything started at the age of three. I uh, started playing drums and I picked up my first pair of drumsticks. I was like a little boy, maybe the same size as, as this drum pad here. I was very, very tiny, had a big head, it was very big. But uh, <laughs> as soon as I started playing, uh, my mom seen me as, as a kid, she seen me, she had a liking to the drums at church. I would always see the drummer play, and I would always be like a kid, just like watching, just enjoying yeah. everything you see. And so my mom was like, oh, so you want to play drums? And I'm like, yes. She said, well, you have to be good in school to play the drums. So as I grew up, um, church was where I started, but um, as I grew up, my mom taught me this, uh, this discipline thing. It's about discipline. If you make the grades, you can yeah. play the drums. If you learn discipline, you be obedient, be kind, be cordial, be genuine. You know, you'll be able to do what you want to do in life. This same motto has been used since I was three and now I'm 32. So I've been doing the same, having the same mindset to travel with this. Funny thing is, I never would have thought that it would have been this big of a blessing to see the whole world. So, so it all started from there to now. So I played um, so many events back home for church events, different artists. Uh, different singers, different musicians, of course, uh, all over Texas um, and, and a few other uh, states outside of Texas. But the blessing of all is is to meet people in different countries yeah. and do what you love. So that's, that's kind of how it all started. Great, great. So um, maybe please introduce some of uh, your favorite musician, okay. drummer, inspiration. Okay. Well. First and foremost, my favorite drummer is Dennis Chambers. Dennis, Dennis Chambers, Chambers is like yeah. still one of my favorite like to this day. He, I used to as a kid, I used to see how fast he would play like the like the, oh, like the yeah, second yeah. note. So I would always like was so fascinated by his speed and the control, like the ghost notes. He's able to play with so much flair, but relaxation. He was very very quick, very sharp. Very, very comfortable. He never, you would never see him like he's having a hard time to play. Yeah. He's enjoy, he just enjoys it. Dennis Chambers is one. Uh, of course, I love Aaron Spears. Um, <laughs> you know, big shout out to Aaron Spears. Aaron Spears also is a like a big inspiration to me. Uh, Chris Dave, also, Chris Dave. also from Texas. Uh, it's so many. Uh, Vinny Kaliuta. Vinny Kaliuta. Um, I, 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 the list goes on and on. I have so many. So, so I, I guess my top five would be Dennis Chambers. 
<laughs> Chris Dave. <laughs> Uh, uh, <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> this is tough because it's only top five. It's very tough. Uh, man, like oh, I cannot believe I, I, I should have said ten, but it's okay. <laughs> ten, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> so, 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 so I'll say Dennis Chambers, Aaron Spears, Chris Dave, Vinny Caliuta, yes, Steve Gadd, yes. Let's go down to Virgil Donati. Oh, uh, Neil Pert, Neil Pert, uh, Brian Blade, Brian Blade, Calvin Rogers. Oh. And my favorite, my most favorite, is a young guy out of out of Texas. Is Tayron Lockett. Tayron Lockett, yeah, favorite. one of my, my favorite drummer. tool, yeah. My favorite drummer, one of my favorite drummers to this day. His groove is so tight yeah. and so genius, guy. Yeah, he's very good. He's oh, very smart. He's playing for Corey Henry. Corey Henry and the Five yeah. Apostles. Yeah. They come to China just before this COVID nineteen. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. At Blue Note. At Blue, Blue Note, Note. Yeah. yes, yes, Blue Note. They play a duet, right? Absolutely. Oh, very genius guy. Yeah. Very so, uh, basically, you know them in person, um, right? I, I, I've, I've been around them before. Like, uh, in Dallas, Dallas, Texas, they had, like, a jam. It's like a jam that musicians get together and play. And I met him. If this was around the time I was still in high school. And I, and I seen him there. And uh, I, I see him playing. It's him, Robert Spud C. Wright. Oh. I've seen, like, a lot of other, you know, guys in there. Like, uh, Sean, I think it's Sean Martin on the piano. But like the, all these guys, like in Texas, for us, it's like it's like all star land. Like oh. you see all famous musicians play everybody. So as a, as a young boy coming up, it's like when you see that, you're like, wow, I'm so inspired. Yeah. So what what happens? You want to practice. You want to grow. It would be better, you know, because people are playing so great. And so I seen Tehran and, and and I met him before. So it was just like, this guy is insane. <laughs> and so you know, you know, Sput really, really inspired a lot of drummers. And a lot of people look up to him. So, and like he's also, one of my, I forgot to put him in my top ten. He's also my favorite because he's more than a drummer. He's more of a he's a producer. He's a Musician. composer. He writes songs, man. Like all the songs on Jinja Live, like he literally like like arranged all of that music. So imagine different songs for each drummer. Like it's he crazy. also played key, right? Absolutely, he plays oh. piano. You know, he produced. I don't know what other instruments he plays. I know he plays drums and keyboard, but I'm pretty sure he plays more than two yeah, instruments. Yeah, definitely, sure. definitely, definitely. But yeah, man, yeah, he's he's a great guy. He's an amazing guy. One of the best. You said you want to share a very cool practice with yeah, us, right? I, so I normally, I normally, uh, I, I do like this uh, paradiddle exercise to kind of, I guess you could say, it kind of helps you relax your muscles and your wrists. Uh, it's, it's basically a single paradiddle, double paradiddle, triple paradiddle, double paradiddle, single paradiddle. It's like an hourglass, so you go forward and then you come back. Ah. It's like it's like a boomerang. Boom, you throw it and come right back to you. So I can demonstrate it. So I say I play it slow. So it's uh, single, double, triple, double, single. That's the whole pattern. So all in 16s, right? right? Right. Okay. So please maybe play again and I clap for you. Cool, okay. Cool, cool. One, two, three, four. That's it. That's it. That's it. Cool. And the cool thing about this exercise is if you have a metronome, you can speed up the tempo. You can play it faster, you can play it slower. <laughs> I do have a metronome. <laughs> you can go pretty fast with it, but it's all about just relaxing the muscles in the hands and just to make it more free. Okay. That's pretty much it. <laughs> Let's try it. We start from okay. 130. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> so, so, we go. One, two, one, two. Yeah. Okay. So that's 130. So how fast do you want to go? <laughs> Let's go 150, okay? okay. 150 it is. <laughs> Yeah, 180 right 180, now. 180. Uh, 
Great, great. Oh, you stop. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try final. 200. Uh, 210, okay. Let's do it. 210. One, two, three, four. Great, great, great. <laughs>